Hey everybody, if you're ever curious about virtual reality, you need to check this place out. It's called Dreamscape Immersive. Currently, there's two locations. There's one in West Los Angeles inside the Century City Mall and North Park Center in Dallas, Texas. So just imagine you stepping into a fantasy world and you becoming part of the story. This experience actually gave me a sense that I was actually stepping into the movie and I was one of the main characters. Okay, so let me explain how this actually works. There are three experiences that you can choose from. Alien Zoo, Curse of the Lost Pearl, and the Blue Deep Rescue. Each experience is $20 per person and you must be 10 years or older. Once you walk in in Dreamscape, you just have to fill up your information on an iPad and you choose your avatar and they'll print you a boarding ticket of your experience. If you choose to, you can book online as well. Up to six people at a time can view an experience. Then the staff leads you into a room to put on your VR gear. There, you'll have to put on some trackers on your hands and feet, computer backpack, and a VR headset. The tech on you tracks your body movements that results in replicating your body movements. Then you're led into this dark room and they just flip on a switch from their iPad. The five people next to you all turn into a virtual avatar that they chose early on the iPad, which makes it more a social experience. I picked the alien zoo as one of my experiences, so the premise of the alien zoo is that you become an explorer in that world. You basically walk into some sort of flying hovercraft and you get transported into outer space and you land in this place which is the alien zoo. The virtual door opens and suddenly you see this huge creature walking across right in front of you. It's unlike any experience I've ever seen. The experience covers all your senses, sight, sound, touch, smell. At one point, a creature actually comes up to you and you can actually reach out and actually touch the creature. So it has physical objects that you can actually touch to give you a greater sense of immersion. There's even a part where the creature actually sneezes on you. It's just a very magical experience that you must experience. So they did a great job merging the virtual world to the physical world. If you pick the Curse of the Lost Pearl experience, it's similar to Indiana Jones type of adventure where you and your team need to find the Lost Pearl. If you're more of an adventurous type of person, definitely choose this experience. This was actually my favorite experience. I don't want to give too much away, but you basically walk through this dark underground ancient ruin with obstacles throughout the experience. You can physically pick up virtual objects like burning torches or giant pearls. Again, think of Indiana Jones. The last experience is called the Blue Deep Rescue. This experience is a bit tamer than the other experiences. You basically become a diver and you're transported onto a deck of a sunken ship with views of sea life. You'll even have a face-to-face -face experience with a giant whale and you'll be pushed around with an underwater scooter as you explore the experience. So if you guys do decide to go, let me know what you think. Until next time guys, talk to y'all later.